A big weekend of homecomings has begun in Hampton Roads. The USS George H.W. Bush Carrier Strike Group will return to the area on Sunday. As always, the Air Wings will return ahead of the carriers and its other ships, and many Navy families are celebrating tonight. Ten on your side, Taylor Mylon was there as one of those airplanes flew in. Global climate forced a series of deployment extensions for USS George H.W. Bush Carrier Strike Group. Now thousands of sailors are making their way back home to Hampton Roads. Today it was the VAW 121 Blue Tail Squadron touching down at Naval Station Norfolk. Our presence in that theater alone, if it can help save one U.S. American life, uh, we all signed up for that. Commander Matthew Campbell and his squadron enduring a lengthy, busy, but successful deployment. If I could sum it up, what this team did was make the impossible look easy. Whether it was their first deployment. It was, uh, it was long, but it was good. It was uh, good to be back there. They kept them safe. That's what matters. That's or their third. Our family is used to it, but it's still, you know, difficult. But as a family, we support each other and just make it through. The E-2 Hawkeyes couldn't hit the tarmac soon enough. So happy, so. Oh, he's home. <laughs> he's home. A mission accomplished abroad. Lieutenant Commander Daniel Marsick has new experiences ahead. On the agenda is softball practice and preschool drop off. Uh, it's going to be busy. <laughs> I'm excited to be back to being a dad. The rest of the carrier strike group is trickling in throughout the weekend. The bush is expected to be in port come Sunday. In the control room, I'm Haley Mylon, 10 on your side.